hydrate me. I make sure I am like lizard. When water pour on lizard, you don't even know that that lizard runs through the water. But if rat pass through water, you will know. You will have, it will take that rat some time for the water to do what? The lizard will pass and, and continue. You will not even shake. So when you want to succeed, make sure that nothing negative can penetrate you. Amen. Negative talks don't allow to penetrate you. When it penetrates you, you Last thing I want to say. Anyone who become a channel of communication for an evil spirit have a familiar spirit. As soon as you become a channel for communication, you have a, you have a familiar spirit. And sometimes we pray against witches and wizards. We never even take time to pray against familiar spirit and wizard. Have you ever been hearing people praying against wizard? Have you ever heard? Them? So if they have witches being women, so they mind now. The wizard, you don't know them. That is why you enter into trouble in their hands. You enter into the trouble of wizard. Today they say they will marry you. Tomorrow they break your heart and break your liver and break your kidney. <laughs> May God help us in Jesus' name. Amen. You are going to pray that God will use you so that any time you stand up to pray, to call upon God in the midnight or any time before you lift up your hands, Heaven will begin to send angels to move towards your direction Amen. and begin to spring the solution of what you are about to pray. And God will tap your back and say, My daughter, you don't need to cry anymore. Amen. Wipe your tears and move to that office. I will be with you. And I will go before you and I will make the crooked place straight. And I will cause them that think you are nobody to know you are somebody. Amen. Those that want to deal with you in their witchcraft cover, they will drink their blood and eat their flesh. Am I talking to somebody here? Those that take your shoe and think that you will not make no move anymore. The Lord said to me to announce to you that from today, they think they have succeeded. But they never know that God is going to replace their children when they put your children. Amen. Am I talking to somebody here? I hear you. Lift up your hand and say, speak to me, sir. Speak to me, sir. Say, speak to me, sir. Speak to me, sir. So you need to understand who you are. Amen. Understand who you are. Sometimes you wake up in the night in your bedroom, stand up and look up and say, who am I, Lord? Yes. Who am I, Lord? Yes. And why am I in Trinidad? Jesus. Yes. You could have made me an American. Yes. But you keep me here. Yes. What's my job? Yes. He will speak to you. Amen. Because he wants to know, he knows that you want to know your identity. Yes. He wants to know you want to know your root. Yes. He wants to know you want to know who you are yes, and do what you're supposed to do. Amen. Instead of you complaining to people about your spouse, about your husband, about your wife, about anything, look up in the morning and upstairs and look up, listen and say, Lord, who am I? Who am I? Lord, who am I? Who am I? Am I talking to somebody here? Yes. Amen. Suddenly you will hear you are the daughter of Zion. Amen. But the problem we have is that when God wants to punch you, when God wants to make sure that things around you, you lift those heavy loads. You think Amen. that those chains in your hands, you think it's bangle. When he say remove those chains, you remove those chains. You say, no, Daddy God, you know, this is not a chain, it's a bangle. You don't talk to God when he wants to save you. Yes, yes, remove yes, some negativity yes, yes. around you. So that you can be able to move forward. Amen. Some of us have been limited to the point that even when the prison door open, we can't even run away anymore. Yeah. Because we feel it's still locked. Yeah. Can I talk to you now? Yes. I will stop by saying this. When the church has the early church has problem, there is a man called James. The Bible said that Herod pick up James, slaughter James. The church was not praying until Peter was picked. And when Peter was back, Peter thought that he's going to die. Peter is in the prison, yeah. delivered in prison to quote for quarterlands of soldiers in the book of Acts of the Apostle. And the Bible said, there, yeah, he starts sleeping. He has given up hope. He never believed he can come out. But the church start praying. The church start kabashing. The church start shouting. They make prayers. They didn't just pray prayers. They make prayers. There is a difference between praying prayer and making prayer. Praying prayer is different 
making prayer is this person is ringing bell this one is behaving like 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 a like catholic person and this one is behaving like pentecostal and this person is behaving like baptist all of them they were praying why the head of the church has been beat and peter was like when the angel come to save peter he thought he's sleeping he thought he's still asleep until he passed all the gates and come back to the church and walk. A little girl come and say, Who is this? He said, I'm Peter. He ran back to tell the church, Peter is at the door. They said, Which Peter? Yeah. We have not finished prayer. Yeah. We have not shared the grace. Why must Peter be there? Yeah. I'm doing somebody here. Yeah. Why must Peter be there? There are prayers you are praying now, and you think you are still praying. You don't know that God has answered. Yeah. Answer. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. 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 Still we are praying. And Peter, they are still praying. They are, that is it. They are not even sensitive. They just say, hey, 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 They are still fasting. They are still praying. And Peter is knocking at the door. And even the person that comes to tell them, stop, prayer is answered. They say, it's a lie. We continue praying. Hey, hey, hey. Until Peter enters. Can I hear some of us? I hear you. I hear you. I have a prophecy for you. If you believe it, you come to pass. Every prayer you pray today, Amen. this week, before the month comes to an end, you will stand in this altar to testify about the goodness of God. Stand on your feet and start thanking God for answering your prayer. Start thanking God for answering your prayer. Open your mouth. Close your hand. Walk around.